Hello violinists, welcome to Prime Strings. I'm Henriette and in this lesson we are learning Ice Dances from the Wagon Wheels book. Now presumably you'll have already played bow ties so you know all about spreading out the notes equally among the whole bow and we're going to practice our counting to three a little bit more clearly now. So will you join me playing Ice Dances? We're going to count to three. We're going to start after three as well. One, two, three. lovely and when you count while you play you get the rhythm of this piece developing really beautifully and that's what we're after here. Shall we play it again just for fun? Now in this piece it says legato underneath the first bar and legato means smooth so let's really work on moving that bow as smoothly as you can and making your bow strokes perfectly straight. We've seen in the past if we play it like this the point of my bow drifts over the fingerboard we don't want it to go there what we can do about it is stretch your arm forward more in that direction and that keeps the point of my bow nicely parallel to the bridge so here we go point your bow forwards one two three sound well done and very smooth playing. Now while you play a piece which is maybe slightly easier than some other pieces it is time to perhaps perfect your left hand hold and I want you to check that that finger line here is still level with the E string when you play. So some people get a habit of sinking down a little bit with their left hand if that is you make sure to hoist it all back up again so that that crease where you're where your first finger is joined onto your hand is level with the E string. Is your thumb nice and up as well? Because we don't want a thumb to be leaning back but it should be nicely upright and then just peeking over the edge. And your thumb is very soft, it's not squeezing the fingerboard at all. So let's see if we can think about all these things while we play. After three, one, two, three. <laughs> Lovely, that piece has a very calming effect on me and I hope it has it on you as well. If you've enjoyed this lesson, 
please like it and do subscribe to the channel. I very much look forward to seeing you in full moon. Goodbye.